it is hot in Chicago Park District pools that many people normally turn to to cool off. Not an option for the summer of 2022. Here at the Abbott Park Splash Pad, Mom Jasmine is here with her three-year-old daughter, Vanity, for a distant second, a.k.a. Plan B. Uh, we're looking for water. <laughs> um, so we just came here because we love the parks. and It's yeah, really hot. <laughs> Chicago Park District officials recently offered $500 signing bonuses to recruit lifeguards. But on the park's website, a quick scroll shows that many of the pools closed last summer and there are no plans to reopen them this summer as well. Mayoral candidate Alderman Ray Lopez, part of a crowded field running against Lightfoot, says he knows there is a lifeguard shortage nationally, but he believes more could have been done locally to fill the spots. You know, as we go into the summer months, you know, it's 100 degrees out in the city of Chicago right now, and I am very concerned that we are not going to be providing our youth with safe opportunities to enjoy water in the parks and they're going to turn to other things like opening hydrants on every block and endangering the neighborhoods in the city of chicago all available lifeguard resources are being deployed to the lakefront at the expense of the neighborhoods which brings us back to jasmine and vanity mom says she'd much rather be in the pool here at abbott teaching her daughter how to swim would you hope that they'd be able to get the pools open sometime this summer? Yes, yes. A lot of kids around here, a lot of moms. Um, yeah, we haven't been able to really find any pools around you here. got to keep them busy, too, with yeah. safe alternatives. Yeah, safe. Sure. <laughs> but seeing that's not a doable option, they'll just have to pass the day splashing away and pretty much having the place to themselves. Patrick Elwood, WGN News. And we did reach out to the mayor's office about the closures. They referred us to the park district. The park district told us it continues to recruit lifeguards. They're currently evaluating staffing numbers right now.